Baloch nationalism is a movement that claims the Baloch people, an ethno-linguistic group mainly found in Pakistan, Iran and Afghanistan are a distinct nation. The movement propagates the view that Muslims are not a nation the opposite of the concept behind the creation of Pakistan and that ethnic loyalty must surpass religious loyalty, though this view has been challenged by both the 1971 independence of East Pakistan and the discrimination many Muhajir people have historically faced within Pakistan. The News International reported in 2012 that a Gallup survey conducted for Defeat revealed that the majority of Baloch do not support independence from Pakistan. Only 37% of Baloch were in favor of independence. Amongst Baluchistan's Pashtun population support for independence was even lower at 12%. However, a majority of Baluchistan's population did favor greater provincial autonomy. <laughs> Baloch ethnicity and nationalism Baloch nationalism is mostly popular in southern and eastern parts of Baluchistan. The Baloch nationalist movement's demands have ranged from greater cultural, economic and political rights, to political autonomy, to outright secession and the creation of an independent state of Baluchistan. The movement is secular and heavily influenced by leftist Marxist ideology, like its other counterparts in other parts of Pakistan. The movement claims to receive considerable support from the Baloch diaspora in Oman, the UAE, Sweden, Norway, and other countries. Pakistan has repeatedly made claims that the Baloch nationalists have received funding from India, although these have been denied by India. A group of U.S. congressmen have expressed support for independent Balochistan, although the official policy of the U.S. government regards the region as a Pakistani province. Texas Congressman Louis Gohmert said in 2012, let's talk about creating a Baluchistan in the southern part of Pakistan. They'll stop the IEDs and all of the weaponry coming into Afghanistan, and we got a shot to win over there. <laughs> <laughs> Modern Baloch nationalism Baloch nationalism in its modern form began in the form of the anjuman e itihad e balochan Organization for Unity of the Baloch based in Mastung in the 1920s, led by Yusuf Aziz Magzi, Abdul Aziz Kurd and others. The aim of the group was to establish political and constitutional reform in the state of Khalid, end of British imperialism, abolition of the Sardari Jirga system, and for the eventual unification of all Baloch lands into an independent state. Simultaneously with the formation of the Anjuman, Baloch intellectuals in Karachi formed a nationalist organization, called the Baloch League. In February 1937, the Anjuman reorganized and became the Khalid State National Party, carrying on the Anjuman's political agenda of an independent United State of Baluchistan. They demand the restoration of the ancient Khanate of Khalid, which was abolished in 1955 AD. The party was dominated by more secular-minded, anti-imperialist and populist elements, such as Gauss Bash Bizenho, Mir Ghul Khan Nazir and Abdul Aziz Kurd. When parliamentary elections were held in the state of Khalid, the party was the largest winners with a considerable majority. The Baloch's constitute only 5% of Pakistani population and felt that their issue not addressed by the federal government. In 2017, the World Baloch Organization placed advertisements on taxis in London to say hashtag Free Baluchistan along with slogans such as Stop Enforced Disappearances and Save the Baloch People. These were initially allowed but later denied permission by Transport for London. The World Baloch Organization claimed that this was a result of pressure from the Pakistani government after the British High Commissioner in Islamabad was summoned to appear before the Pakistani Foreign Secretary. See also Separatist movements of Pakistan Baloch National Front Baloch Liberation Army Baluchistan conflict Insurgency in Baluchistan